What's up everyone? So I'm back with a, my first DIY video, one of many more to follow. So <coughs> sorry, <coughs> I sound like a dying cow because I've been sick for the last two days. Um, but yeah, basically this is going to be a DIY video, many to follow. Um, as some of you may already know who know me already, I love being creative and like when I see something it inspires me, like I just like to do it. Um, so this is going to be my first, <coughs> my first DIY video um, and today we're going to be making this. So, I saw these um, at Pottery Barn in Chadston and they were about like $250 and I've seen them a lot like in a lot of vloggers like in their background <coughs> and just like glamorous decor basically um, and I've always wanted to get one because it looks really cool but I wasn't going to pay $250 for it so I found this a square vase and um, yeah, and I'm so excited because I'm gonna create my own. And I went out, <coughs> don't mind my bills. <laughs> went out, got this long sponge and these roses. And I'm basically gonna create my own. <coughs> so this cost me $3. Cost me a dollar fifteen, so we're at four dollars fifty yeah. Then I got three of these bunches that were two dollars each. Um, so six, ten dollars fifty. So with only ten dollars fifty, I'm gonna try and recreate this. And yeah, and I'm gonna place it here. to go with my candle, like my light candle and this sponge spray by the way. And basically it's going to be on my dresser. Um, I've just moved into this room because I was in the next door um, and the theme in my room, don't mind the mess, I was just shopping, is <laughs> like, oh, that I got for my present from my boss, is like this grey teal white theme. So let's see how this goes. Okay, so first things first, put our bars, and as I said again, this was like three dollars. I picked it up, like I think it's like a reject shop or something. So yeah, I was originally gonna do them like just like this and leave like so you can see the stems, but I don't know. Sorry about that breathing. <laughs> But I thought I was gonna put this in here <coughs> and then just have them all like standing on top. I don't know. Anyway, let's see how we go. I'm gonna measure this out. Yeah. Measure that way. You know what they say? Measure twice, cut once. That's what the others say. Okay, so I've measured my line. I think I'm going to need scissors for this. I'll be back. Sorry. I meant a knife. Okay, this might get messy. Alright. So. Okay, and normally I'm going to fill this with water to make it heavy, but I don't even think I'm... Gosh. Fail. Measure twice, cut once. Oh wait, maybe it's supposed to be this part. So cool. Oh my lord. Guys. Save. So easy to cut. Ugh. Oh, 
Alright, there we go. So we've got that in there. Now, what I was originally going to do was cut the stems in half and then place the upper half of the stem around the outside so it looks like it's whatever. Anyway, I'm so out of breath. And this is a really bad angle. But oh well. So, as you can see, they're all like single stem. Yeah, I think we're gonna cut it in half. Oh my gosh, they're not even. Oh, because I could just break them. Okay. So, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place the. And I'm going to continue that all the way around on top. And then what I was going to hopefully do with this on the side. It's not even touching the camera. Fail as, guys. Okay, there. Let's we'll put these out along the side. Anyway, I'll show you what I mean after. <sighs> okay. Oculus. Anyway, let me know what you guys enjoy DIYing yourselves and and you don't want to put them too close otherwise it's going to be too cool. So you want to make sure, oh crap I just squashed a flower. <laughs> Fail. Oh no, yep. See, that's looking fine. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Ugh. But yeah, anyway guys, let me know what you guys like to DIY and if there's anything you want me to attempt. Or put do a spin on because I enjoy doing these stuff like I enjoy like decorating love decorating so like I, I help out a lot with like events um, even at church yes work so looking good so far got four but I don't like the look of the sponge Let's just continue and see how we can fix it up later, okay? Don't mind the angle, man. Like, I'm really in my face. Like, I've been so sick. I'm being like, not even worried about anything. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm breaking out really bad, but. Okay, so I figured I can work four across and four down. Hopefully, I've got enough roses. But yeah. Um, what do you call it? Yeah, I want to do a Christmas like centerpiece one as well. So let me know what you guys are doing for like Christmas decos. Um, I saw this centerpiece like that interprets candles. Um, so I want to, yeah, I want to sort of try and do that in a while. But yeah, let me know um, what you guys enjoy DIYing or if you guys don't or like fails like DIY fails like like how this started oh my gosh guys how good does that look loser loser anyway also shout out to Giovanni it's his five months today and for those of you who follow me on Insta Snapchat Facebook y'all probably see that I love that child five months today and what I've seen some people do is like they like dust it on top of like bronzer or something just to like give it that nice rose gold effect but I'm gonna keep it white and I might even take it to work to put on my desk anyway 
anyway I'm just gonna continue doing this Okay guys, so one bunch is definitely not going to be enough, so lucky I brought two. I knew three was going to be an overkill, but I wanted to use this on another vase to sort of keep the same flowers going throughout. Really, really happy with the way it's looking. There's a few gaps though. So I'm on to the second bunch now. Sorry, I lost my tripod. So, so whoever's got it, if we can return it, that'll be great. But yeah, these are so cute, and they're only two dollars a bunch, and you get. out of a bunch. fail. So I poked the flower through and the wire inside the stem poked up. I poked me in the finger. Do you know it's going to be dangerous? Gosh. But yeah, again, apologies about the, the angle. Oh my gosh, you can see my room. Again, snap it. And this is our last one, guys. Fluff it up a bit. Yay! And voila! So, you know, do you know what I mean? But the sides look a bit ugly. But what I was gonna do was make these. <clears throat> would make them go like like a border like around here but inside so it doesn't look but I think what I might do is just oh, I have a ribbon hold on oh sorry ta-da yes guys look Does that go or does that not? Sorry, I got so much notifications coming through. Yay, nay. Should we just leave it? Guys, now that I think about it, I'm like, really? Should I tie a ribbon on it? I'd prefer a white, a white ribbon, but that I don't have. Sorry about the noise. My dad's just going off his nut because so my dad drives a bus and he parks it like he parks it like um, on the main road because like our neighbors complain about like squeeze their cars through our street because it's like we're on a court so um and me and my 
brother when I got dinner. Um, we got fish and chips. And uh, my brother realised that um, someone had knocked the mirror on my dad's bus. And he comes home and my dad's like, and he's like to my dad, oh, here's dinner, fish and chips. Oh, and here's your mirror <laughs> from your bus. So my dad is going absolutely apeshit. Okay guys, so I decided to tie a bow on it, don't judge me on my bow, but I'm going to put it in place and then light the candles and then let me know and then I'll show you the final piece, okay? Okay guys, there you have it, that's the final, final piece, looks great, um, yeah, so I have it with my candles, this one's a really nice one, it's a coriander and mandarin smells amazing and this one's just a tropical one <coughs> um but yeah that's my diy square rose vase and i've got it sitting on my dresser there um but yeah hope you guys enjoyed that video um hey guys so just when i was about to end the vlog so you know <coughs> the leftover half of the sponge I found another square thing <laughs> and I think I'm gonna this one is like a cardboard box like it's like a crate and I've still got leftover roses so <coughs> this is what originally near my bed on my bedside table um, and it usually just held my keys and stuff like as my palm phone whatever since I walked in the room, but I'm gonna turn this into a bath as well. Yay! So, as you can see, I've already cut the sponge to shape, fit them perfectly, and then back to the process. So, for I've had that for a while, it used to be in like makeup brushes, but it's just been, yeah. For nothing meaningful but I'm gonna make life of it so for ten dollars fifty I get two of these nice vases square roses thing <coughs> compared to 250 for one oh they look so good already yay I'm just going to continue on with this and then I'll come back to you. Hail, if you can hear the karaoke in the background, that's my mum and dad. <laughs> Sometimes I get really bored because like my brother and his um, missus and their kids moved out. <coughs> And then my other um, sister and her husband and her kids moved out and now our house is like really quiet so I think my parents get bored really easily so they find things to keep themselves entertained and like I think they're going through a midlife crisis because like yeah all of a sudden my dad rocks up with these two giant speakers that do karaoke and like both <laughs> so this is how it's looking so far. Um, damn it. This one I sort of stuffed up. Oh crap. It's gonna look amazing.
Dynamo. All right, ready? <coughs> and ta-da! Yay, how cute does this look? I might take this one to my desk. Sorry. But yeah, I'll show you where I'm placing this one. Okay guys, that's where I placed that one. So on my bedside drawers, I wanna say table. Um, next to this, I haven't lit this candle yet, but it's a um, um, soy blend Saxon wood saffron mango. Um, that's just a vanilla one. These are the candles we had for my nana's 80th, and I've got a photo of my nana and my dad and my niece and nephew on my bedside table. <coughs> right next to my bed, don't mind the messy bed. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's where I'm going to place that one. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that video. Let me know if there's other stuff you want me to um, create on a budget. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm very happy for this DIY um, section of things. I had to put my hair up because it was like so hot. But um, yeah, comment down below if there's thing, other things you want me to try. Um, and yeah, apart from that, um, um, I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and yeah, see you later.